An army of volunteers turning blue latitudes in Dover into Thanksgiving Central. In this, the 13th year, a feast for nearly 800. We got about 840 pieces of pie, 1,092 pounds of turkey, 384 pounds of mashed, 150 pounds of uh, green beans, 250 pounds of stuffing, and approximately 26 gallons of gravy is what we've done today. COVID nixing a sit-down meal. I do miss the in-person aspect. I really hope we can get back to that next year um, because it's just a nice sense of community and everyone really enjoys it. Instead, each meal is packaged individually and put into coolers to stay warm. Truly turkey and all the trimmings. There's boxes of rolls and butter, cranberry sauce, pie, candy, times 800, all of them packed by hand. All of it rolled out and into waiting vehicles to be delivered across the Dover community. Those facing food insecurity, um, a lot of the shelters in the community, um, some of the other organizations that support children and families. And there's something new to the effort. This is the first year that we've created a 501c3 nonprofit organization named Thanks for Giving Charity Inc. Um, the goal and the mission of the organization is to do more. Serving up the spirit of giving and giving thanks well beyond the holiday that inspired it. In Dover, Jennifer Crompton, WMUR News 9.